Are you putting defender down after defender or fighter down after fighter and still being overran? Don't worry, guys. I got just what you need. Apocalypto here, another watcher of Realms video. You can call me Apoc. And today we're going to go over a little bit of crowd control, right? When you're getting hammered with a thousand little guys and you're needing to slow them down, take control of the situation so all your DPS guys can start doing what they do best, right? Taking out the baddies, right? So in order to crowd control and control the large amount of individuals there doing whatever they're doing, and so that you can do what you need to do, freezing is a great way to do that, right? So that's why we call this epic the crowd control champion of all epics. It's AI, guys. Let's take a look. And boom, there she is. AI, the most epic of epics right here. Now, this character was always pretty good. Don't get me wrong. Has always been pretty good. But ever since Boris came out and, and start, started really enhancing the damage dealt on the duration of freeze, ha, AI's worth has went through the roof, through the roof. But we're not talking about that right now. We're going to focus on the crowd control and what you can use his character solely on just about any aspect of the game when it comes to controlling the crowd. Let's get into it. So just like with all heroes, what you're going to do here is you're going to start at the top. And you're going to work your way down. First, it's the tributes. We want to make sure and six star this character out. Always, first off, right off the bat, six star it out. Let's try to get the, uh, um, you know, the farmable XP saved so that we can go ahead and just knock it out as soon as we get the character. Then you go to promotion raid. This is where you may have to run a few raids, uh, I mean, a few promotions in the promotion raid to get all the, uh, you know, promotion material needed. Once you get this character up to six purple stars, six purple, not gold, purple, it gotta be all purple, that's when you know you have them fully maxed out with the uh, promotions. Next, we can focus on gear. But just like with any character, you can't just go around slapping gear on them all willy-nilly. You got to figure out exactly what gear you need to put on that. And how do you figure that gear out? Well, I want to answer your question right now. Take a look at the skills. Once you look at the skills, it's going to tell you what the character does. Each character has a specific trait in which that they're particularly good at, right? Some may have one or two, maybe three, but, but it's always, you know, just a, just a few, maybe a single uh, individual skill uh, that, that makes that, that individual uh, hero very, very good. And with this one, we can take a look and see what that is. Let's see, talents, none available there, so we'll drop down to the ultimates. It is the auto frost bombs. When activated, every attack immediately summons a crystal bomb for 25 seconds. Now, that's pretty fancy. That's pretty fancy. All right, let's go to the next. So it summons one ice seed on the ground. The ice seed transform into a crystal bomb after a period of time. So we're just talking about freeze bombs left and right. Speaking of which, performing a summon on a crystal bomb enhances it, stacking it up to two times. After the first enhancement, the crystal bomb deals magic damage equal to 440% attack and inflicts freeze. Jeez. I mean, does it bring me a sandwich too? I mean, God dang, that... There's all kinds of stuff and 440%. That's fancy. Let's keep it moving. After the second enhancement, Crystal Bomb deals AOE damage equal to 680% attack and inflicts freeze. It just keeps going. 680? I mean, guys, that, that's pretty outrageous. All right. Uh, forming a zone that slows down the enemies for three seconds. So you, not only do you get the freeze, but you get the three second slowdown. Then you get the 680% damage. Then you get the 400% damage. I mean, this, this, this girl is just damage, 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 damage everywhere you go. Now that we know that each attack is all about a crystal bomb that freezes and slows, we see here is activated immediately after a summon. Every attack immediately summons a crystal. So we're definitely going to want to speed up the attack. Summon one's ice. Okay, crystal bomb enhances it, stacking two times. We're just going over it real quick. So we see AoE damage we see a slowing effect and we see the um, uh, every attack, right? So we're gonna wanna try to speed them up and then of course just damage, damage, damage. That's why I put the Night Terror set, or uh, uh, yeah, Night Terror set on this guy, this lady, I should say. All right, I put the attack bonus right there, 60%. I'm lucky enough to get a little attack uh, in the gold there, so I slapped it on her. Healing effect there and rage regen. Rage regen is going to be really effective there. <clears throat> All right, next set, HP bonus as well. Uh, now on this one here, you could actually, if, if you had a better piece, you could actually do the attack bonus. The attack bonus would be better than the HP bonus. 
The only reason I'm running this particular piece, I mean, look at it, all the rest of the stats are purple. I mean, how can I not run this piece? You know what I'm saying? It's just the, uh, the, the, the uh, cumulative stats overall is just far superior than another piece. So that's why I'm using that one. Then you look at the attack bonus, 60% there. So I got the attack bonus, HP bonus, should be attack bonus. And then the attack bonus there, right? That's going to help you there. Now, instead of this HP, right? If you just wanted to run two attacks, the other option you could do is really enhance your uh, critical, uh, blah, 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 your critical damage, right? That's the other option you could do is really increase that, or you know, throw a, an attack speed piece on it. You know, that'd be another option as well too. Maybe even a rage regen piece. That'd be a great third option as well. All right. So then over here, just worried about the attack. I threw this piece on there. It was what it was, but I was just getting the attack down and look at that. You got a little bit of healing, got a little bit of defense. I could probably actually find a better, better attack piece here. Let's see what we can get. Ooh, let's see. Nine attack, crit rate. I actually need a better crit rate. Dangerously need a better crit rate. Jesus. What we got here, guys? What we got? What we got? What can we, what, 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 Oh, no, I thought I had some HP attack. Oh, some of this gear is embarrassing. I can't believe I'm showing you guys. It's like I'm showing you guys dirty underwear. <laughs> uh, there we go. Crit rate 21. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we'll slap it on there right there. Boom. Check that out now. Attack is, is, is up there. Got the critical damage is doing pretty good. Yeah, even though it's not that effective since we're only at a 43% crit rate. Every little bit counts. Rage region up to 24 and the attack right at, look, what is this? Let's see. Let's see. Just, just for giggles. Woo. Look at that. Almost 150 thou. That's fancy. That's fancy. Then when you match that with Boreas, Boreas starts pumping out his ultimate. Now you have a pretty good team and synergy there. Maybe even throw a little, little Mari in there, a little, uh, um, uh, a little mall in there. Yeah. Now you got a synergistic team, freeze team. Right? Maybe that's what we'll do next. All right, guys, that's a, oh, we forgot to go over uh, uh, artifact. All right, guys, last but not least, let's check out the artifact on this bad baby here. Let's see. Heaven's Rage is what I currently have on her. If you look, I got a thir 11 out of 13. So we're almost to the 13 mark. And then we can start up into the next one there. But the reason I have this on her is a critical hit increases critical damage by 28% for three seconds. Now, this piece is only highly effective if you have the crit rate at 95, 100%. Mine is not where it needs to be. So what I can do is I can come over here and just find a set that has better. Yeah, see, that's, that's almost. We could do better, better. Come on, what we got? What we got? There we go. See, it's a lot better crit rate, but we have a lower attack. So let's look at. Let's look at it. That'd be great. AOE attack there, huh? And you got a 25% rage regen. Crit rate goes up 70. But we got 3,000 drop. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. What do we got? What do we got? No. Damage increases. No, no. All right, guys. I think we'll go with that. Come back over here. There we are. Just over 100% crit rate. We have, you know, let's do this. Say so just over 100% crit rate. We have our critical damage now at 200%. We have the attack, uh, uh, where is it? Where is it? The attack speed, there we go, 172. So that helps an additional 72. And then you have the attack just over 100,000. Just an over 100,000. That's really gonna help you be effective with the explosions. All those explosions just murdering everyone. All right, guys, so we got the artifact on them. We got the crit rate on her, and now we are effective. We can take care of business. Uh, yeah, yeah, once you get to A5, you know, that's definitely nice too, right? Check this guy out. Guy, gal, I should say. All right, from there, we'll check out the A1, 2, 3, 4, 5, the Awakenings, right? Let's go at A1. A1, increase the damage of the Crystal Bomb by 50%. That can be dangerous. All right, attack plus five. Yeah, nothing to shake a stick at. And then you got the A3. A3 says the explosion caused by each crystal bomb affects two additional targets when it is not enhanced or only enhanced one time. Now that's just further enhancing the AOE damage right there. Your A4, rage regen, auto plus one. You know, every little bit helps. And A5. Now this is where the power of the punch is right here. 
freeze effect of all crystal bombs plus one percent in in the duration now now that is highly effective especially with boreas because boreas gives additional damage based on the duration of of freeze and that right there my friend is called synergy all right guys that is the end of it if you like what you saw give me a like i'd appreciate it if you have any feedback put in the comments and uh make sure to subscribe if you want like uh more watcher of realms content and check me out on twitch try to stream just about every day from 10 a.m to about 12 ish or you know till i feel like stopping that's kind of how it works all right guys see you next time apoc out